Alex Eubank First Cycle, Freunde, mit der Mickey Mouse Stimme. Let's go. With this comment, people are saying, here's proof yet again that Alex Eubank is not natural. And so, how many times... Ich muss weiter essen. Es schmeckt einfach zu gut. Entschuldigung, Game Changer. Are we gonna have to expose him? How many times do you have to talk about this? Coach Greg, in today's video, the comment that went viral. Yet again, people exposing Alex Eubank. Three years ago, he posted a comment on... Alex Eubank gibt doch, hat die ganze Zeit gesagt, er ist netti, oder? War das nicht, oder hat er zugegeben, dass er stofft? Er hat gerade gesagt, exposed. 1200 Kalorien durch Riegel läuft. Ja, heute ist, heute ist Freestyle, Digga. Heute ist Samstag. Brandon Clark's wall and someone posted the comment on Reddit and so everyone is now talking about it. What about that comment under Brandon Clark's video? Greg Doucette, didn't you see his comment about him asking about SARMs for his first cycle? What about the comment about you starting your cycle? And so with this comment, people are saying, here's proof yet again that Alex Eubank is not natural. And so, how many times are we gonna have to expose him? Ich bin gespannt, wann er ein Video über mich macht, dass ich nicht natural bin, obwohl ich natural bin. How many times you have to talk about this? And so, just a quick backstory in case you're new to. Er sieht ja schlimmer aus als Thunfisch. All this, I previously made videos where I stated I don't believe that Alex Eubank is 100% natural. And so I've stated that he took a SARM or some form of performance enhancing drug that suppresses natural production of testosterone. And more recently, he went over some of his blood work, noticed some of it, not all of it, and in that he showed. Ich verstehe gar nicht, warum der Typ so ein Heft. Also optisch ist er, vielleicht hat er eine krasse Persönlichkeit, weil optisch finde ich ihn überhaupt nicht krass. Null. Digga, geh in McFit, in Fittig, da siehst du 50 Mal Leute, die sehen besser aus als der. Testosterone level. Wahrscheinlich ist es seine Persönlichkeit. Ich habe über 900 Nanogramm pro Deciliter gejumpt. Ich spekulierte, dass es wahrscheinlich vielleicht 99% der Probabilität ist, dass es das Resultat von ihm in Clomiphin nimmt, das ist ein Produkt, das deine Testosterone-Levels verbessert und wahrscheinlich das, was er gerade erlebt hat. Clomiphin nimmt er? Ich weiß nicht, was likely perhaps 99% probability that it's the result of him taking in clomiphene which is a product that boosts your testosterone levels and would most likely cause what he was experiencing and following this we showed video of him talking about HGH boosters SARMs and so on and to add to this we now see a comment from three years ago where he's talking about SARMs I'm going to read the comment gonna see what people say ja klar aber du kannst doch keine Pizza vergleichen mit einem leicht verdaulichen Mehl, wo du Kohlenhydrate drin hast, äh, gesunde Fette, leicht verdauliche Kohlenhydrate und leicht verdauliches Protein mit einer Tiefkühlpizza. Vielleicht passen da die Kalorien, aber das ist nicht dasselbe. Said about it, and so let's get right into it. And in case you're wondering, I actually like. Krass, die haben sogar zusammen mal gedreht. Und jetzt exposed er hier oder? Alex Eubank, I speak to him in private. I try to help him out. And so it's not like we're enemies. You're thinking that we have hate for each other, that there's some kind of a beef. They're actually... Also, kein böses Blut hier. ...he isn't. I'm just very impartial, unbiased, and I'm going to tell you what I think no matter what. And so I was in a bike race, and I received a message from Alex Eubank. He was saying, are you seeing what all these people are saying about this one comment that <clears throat> I made years ago? And is he talking about it? I wrote to him and I said, what comment? He says, I'm driving my car. I'll explain it to you later on. And so it's been later on. It's been a few days and he hasn't yet brought it up again. And so perhaps he assumed Finde ich aber nicht korrekt, dass die hier Chatverläufe liegen. Das finde ich gehört sich nicht. I'd seen the comment as everyone was tagging me and he wanted to talk about it to explain why he made the comment. I'm about to hop on LGD, Rad 140, Osterine. MK, and that's short for MK677, Ibutamorin. Das will er als ersten Cycle nehmen? So beschissene Psalms, Digga? Was? Nicht sein Ernst, oder? And maybe some YK11 for my first cycle. Also das wäre wirklich richtig, richtig dämlich. Ohne Witz. What do you think will happen? And so... Deine Leber würde abschmieren. The first thing you need to know is that those are a list of SARM selective androgen receptor modulators. They're not steroids, but they are in fact banned by WADA. MK677, on the other hand, it's not a SARM. It's a growth hormone secretagogue. And so it boosts your growth hormone levels, your IGF-1 in the blood, causes you to get hunger and put on muscle. And so remember, 
Alex Eubank had made a video in the past and he's told people to take an HH booster, to take a SARM. And I discussed this video and in that video I described that Alex Eubank did not seem knowledgeable on what he was talking about. And so perhaps he simply was trying to tell people not to take SARMs but to take a GH booster. Not a SARM, not a hormone, nothing bad. HGH boost by water simply something to boost your growth hormone levels perhaps vitamins minerals and so on not unlike taking a test booster like G test Der, der macht placements wie kein anderer ne auch im letzten video unfassbar junge there are no banned hormones in here and you can take this it's perfectly legal you do not lose your natty card Digga, nehm einfach 125 milligramm alle drei vier tage und halt die fresse Ganz einfach. But in this comment, he's quite literally listing SARMs and products that some people have not even heard of. I do believe he must have researched SARMs. How would he have listed YK11? Not many people have even heard of this. On top of LGD, MK, Rad140, Austrine, my personal belief, this is what I think after hearing all of this, is that Alex Eubank would have been researching SARMs in case he was going to take them. When I was in my early and mid 20s, for example, I absolutely had no interest whatsoever in taking steroids. And so I did not research them. I didn't know what they did. I couldn't name them. And so to me, I was oblivious to this. But later in my career, for example, once I hit my 30s, I thought, hmm, I think one day I may in fact take steroids and so I should start learning about them. If I ever do decide to take them. Keiner macht sich vorher Gedanken oder niemand, also die meisten, die anfangen zu ballern, informieren sich gar nicht richtig über was bewirkt es in meinem Körper, was sind die Wirkungen, Nebenwirkungen. Wie setze ich überhaupt ab und 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 die meisten legen einfach direkt los. Ist so. Ah, für Masse, Masse gut, okay, ich nehme ein bisschen Deka, Bruder, weil ist für Masse. Ach, Diät, ich nehme ein bisschen Trenbolon, Bruder, weil ist verbrennt, ne? Macht trocken. Trenbolon macht trocken, Bruder. Ja, das ist das sind die McFit Leute heutig in den heutigen Zeiten. Ja, die wissen weder, was macht es in deinem Körper, was passiert. Einfach rein damit. Irgendwo was aufgegriffen gehört und rein damit. Nicht gut, Freunde. Und an dieser Stelle gibt es eine ganz kurze Werbeunterbrechung. Falls ihr mich supporten möchtet, Freunde, besucht auf jeden Fall esn.com. Denn dort sichert ihr euch mit dem Rabattcode William immer den besten Deal. Unter anderem beispielsweise auf ein leckeres Designer Whey Protein. Und schaut auch unbedingt auf OAS vorbei. Da findet ihr beispielsweise dieses wunderschöne Tanktop und auch andere geile Klamotten, die ihr auch im Alltag anwenden könnt. Ebenfalls Rabattcode William, alle Links in meiner Videobeschreibung und weiter geht's mit dem Video. I want to be an expert on everything that I'm taking. And so I began to read about mm. all of them. What are the side effects? What do they do and at what doses? And so I would ask my friends, the competitive bodybuilders, what are you taking and at what doses and why? And I would listen to their answers and think, these guys are idiots. Why are they doing this? Why are you taking D-ball and a draw before you go up on stage? Are you not worried about the bloating? And so I quickly realized that I knew more about steroids than the majority of bodybuilders who were taking them. And so perhaps Alec Dubank was trying to amass some knowledge about these products and was doing more research than last time. And so I do believe Natürlich, Kevin, wäre ich anders, wenn ich sowas nehmen würde. Dann würde ich mich definitiv vorher schlau machen. Ja. So was von einem richtigen Kevin kommt so eine Frage, da war ja klar, dass der mir hier misstrauisch ist. Nein, Spaß, Digga. Äh, safe, hätte ich, äh, würde ich anfangen zu ballern, würde ich mich natürlich vorher informieren. Aber wir distanzieren uns natürlich auf diesem Kanal und in diesen Streams von jeglichen Medikamentenmissbrauch. Der Preuße 8502 abonniert. Ich danke dir, mein Lieber. That unlike many of the people who have stated, this is the proof that we needed to show that he was on a cycle back then. That I personally believe that this was a joke. The ending of the sentence, what do you think will happen, all spelt as if it's Coach Greg typing a post. I think he spelled it like this on purpose to signify that this is a joke. But what often happens is that people can only understand what's being written. Imagine if English isn't your first language. You have a hard time reading sarcasm. And so what one person might think is factual, another person will say that was clearly a joke. And so when Seth Barossi said he believed that Michael Hearn was natural, that he was an alien, he didn't actually think that Michael Hearn... <laughs> Michael Hearn was natural and alien. Was natural and he was an alien. So, Michael Hearn's natty, huh? 
You know what? You cookbook you. Cookbook all of you. I saw the comments and all of a sudden I'm the asshole because Seth Ferrosi, einer meiner Lieblingsbodybuilder aus, ich glaube nicht doch, der ist aus den Staaten oder Kanadier, ich bin mir gerade nicht sicher, aber im Englischsprachigen, seine Videos habe ich gesuchtet, gesuchtet ohne Ende. Jeden Vlog, alles geguckt. Seth Ferrosi, brutal, zieht euch die alten Videos von ihm rein. I made a joke about Mike O'Hearn being an alien. You really think Seth thinks that Mike O'Hearn is natural? Of course. Was brüllen die denn da so rum bei mir auf der Terrasse? Auf dem Hof. Of course not. Who in the world thinks Michael Hearn is natural? But listen, just because this perhaps is a joke and that video where he's talking about growth hormones to Mama im Terrassentür zu, ich lasse laufen, ich höre zu. Predigogs and taking SARMs and so on, that perhaps he was not referring to anyone actually taking SARMs, not taking MK677. I still, to this day, still believe exactly what I've stated. I like Alex Eubank. I like what he stands for. I like what he's doing. I like all of it. But just like me, just like everyone, we all make mistakes. Is anyone actually perfect? And so still to... Nobody is perfect, friend. To this day, I still believe he's not 100% natural. I still believe that he's taken in Clomiphen. Perhaps he's still taking it right now. I don't know. But does that mean he's a bad person? Does that mean you shouldn't watch his channel? Of course. Ja, wenn der Leute verarscht, dann ist er ein scheiß Fake Netty und ist nicht korrekt. Of not. And some of you might speculate, oh, this is going to damage his reputation. No one will get over this. Oh, it's so bad. Oh my goodness. Really? Have you not ever heard of the Liver King? The Liver King. <laughs> Liver King, Alter, der war auch. Als sein Steak gelegt worden ist, Junge, 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 Junge. King was exposed, shown to not only be not natural, but to be spending over $10,000 a month on performance enhancing drugs. He, he made that fake... 10.000 Dollar Steak pro Monat. Apology. And to this day, he said, oh, I stopped back then. Now I'm 100% natural now. Yet he's even leaner than freaking last time. And so did it actually matter? And so no matter how bad something gets, no matter how many people talk about you in a negative way, it's the flavor of the day and perhaps of the week. In a month from now, everyone's going to jump on to the next big story. Oh my goodness, it's Shizzy Twizzy. What is that then? Shizzy Twizzy? Nee. Natural. Coach Greg got a new video on him. Stay tuned for that one. And no What is that then for a type, Alter? Can't you anyone? No matter what, people are going to talk about it for a little while. And yes, it is upsetting to the person involved. But they have to understand that this is the YouTube world. And so if Alex Eubank had never Jeder kennt den, ich nicht. had any controversy on him ever, do you really think he would be as popular as he is? I don't know Shizzy, I hear it for the first time. Right now, if only the positive thing Also, if he's with those two Trend Twins, he's normal that he's got something in there. Had ever happened to him? Do you really think he would be the person he is today? I don't think so. The trials, tribulation, the stress is put on your body, on your mind, those things allow you to grow. And if it never happens, if you were never exposed to sadness, to suffering, you would never become the person that you are today. And it's happened to him in the past, and yet here he is. Millions of followers, millions of dollars. And so do you really think it's Bars and dollars. hurting him that much. If the worst thing that's happened to you in your life is that people don't believe you that you're natural or that you're enhanced, is that really the end of the world? I don't think so. Every time I post a natural photo of myself from when I was in my 20s, people are saying, that's Cap. Come on, coach, admit it. You were not natural. Yet I actually was. And so how can I convince you? Well, I can't. I can just say, here's my photo. I am natural. Believe it or don't believe it. Whether I'm natural or enhanced now or in the past, does it really matter? Does it affect you? Just because I can look that good when I was in my 20s. Und das ist das wie beim Deutsch, ne, als Beispiel. Entweder man glaubt der Person das oder nicht. So, mehr als sagen oder ein Blutbild präsentieren kann man ja eh nicht. Ja, am Ende des Tages muss die Person selbst wissen, ob er seine Community, seine Leute verarscht für ein paar Klicks und Likes mehr und Reichweite oder nicht. Also, ich würde mich schämen, Digga. Schämen, abgrundtief. Wenn ich äh, am Ballern wäre und jeden sagt, ich bin die ganze Zeit natural und ziehe das komplett ernst durch, ja? Ja, es geht nicht. Stell dir mal vor. It doesn't mean you can, and it doesn't mean you can't. And so, regardless of what comes out of this, believe what you want. Do you believe that Alex Eubank is natural, or do you believe that he's enhanced? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you matter. And you might be thinking, yeah, but that physique. Diese Stelle hier fuckt mich so ab. Die kommt schon zum zehnten Mal richtig behindert. Is natural attainable? Yes, of course it is. 
Many people diese Schrottkörper hier. People with gifted genetics could look as good as Alex Eubank or even better. And so when trying to decide if somebody is natural hence, please don't just look at their physique and say, could it be possible that a person on this earth could do that natural? Because trust me, somebody can. Ron Der ist natural gewesen da, ja. Ronnie Coleman as a natural looked far better than all of these guys. All the natty or nots I've ever done on all these individuals, Ronnie Coleman as a 100% natural guy beats all of them. And so just because Ronnie could do it doesn't mean that we all can. Work harder than last time, compare yourself to yourself, and be happy with what you can do. And so let me know in the comment section, did you actually think this was real? Did you really think he would just simply out himself and make a comment on his friend's wall and say, hey everyone, these are all the Sarms, all four... Ich glaube nicht, das wäre richtig dumm. Ich glaube, das ist wirklich einfach nur ein Joke. Der wollte durch diesen Post einfach, glaube ich mal, die Leute... Hops nehmen, bisschen Aufmerksamkeit auf sich ziehen, safe. Of them plus this that I'm gonna take right now? Of course not. And so it was a joke. It doesn't change my opinion. I've stated my opinion in the past. You can watch my other videos ending it here. Looking to stay 100% natural, click the link in the description. You can get things like Ecti Builder, Geo. Also mit den Produkten könnt ihr zu 100% natural, naturalen Look erreichen, Freunde. <lacht> oh man. Oh Mann, ja also Freunde, ist für mich, er sieht natural aus, er ist Alex Eubank, der ist für mich, was den Körper angeht, da sieht der Fake-Stoff Atunfisch schon krass aus, ich finde ihn jetzt überhaupt nicht krass, wahrscheinlich hat er eine krasse Persönlichkeit oder die Mädels feiern ihn, weil er hübsch ist oder so ein Ladyboy, äh, Ladyboy, <lacht> nicht Ladyboy, sondern einfach so ein äh, Typ, auf den Frauen stehen, ich glaube, wie komme ich auf Ladyboy, Digga? Fanboy, keine Ahnung, ihr wisst, was ich meine. Aber sonst vom Körper her finde ich den überhaupt nicht krass. So, das ist auf jeden Fall, äh, das ist auf jeden Fall natural erreichbar. Vielen, vielen lieben Dank fürs Zuschauen, Freunde. Und falls ihr mich supporten möchtet, schaut auf jeden Fall bei esn.com vorbei. Mit Rabattcode William sichert ihr euch wie immer den allerbesten Deal. Beispielsweise auf ein leckeres Isoclear. Aktuell trinke ich sehr gerne im Sommer. Den Raspberry Geschmack. Gebt mir noch zwei Wochen. Punkt.com ist jetzt online. Da könnt ihr euch aktuell drei verschiedene geile Designs sichern. Alle Links wie immer in der Videobeschreibung. Und falls ihr auf der Straße oder im Gym den Dicken machen wollt, schaut unbedingt bei oace.com ab, denn dort habt ihr auch immer den besten Deal mit Rabattcode William. Da gibt es zum Beispiel diese wunderschönen Tanktops, womit ihr wirklich im Gym aussieht wie eine brutale Maschine. Vielen lieben Dank fürs Zuschauen. Schaut auf jeden Fall auch dreimal die Woche bei Twitch vorbei um 20.30 Uhr, Montag, Mittwoch, Freitag sind wir online. Alle Links in der Videobeschreibung. Vielen lieben Dank und bis zum nächsten Mal.